This is your breakthrough word in a minute, and the word this week is you can turn it around. There are times in life when you can get off track and you need to turn around. Could be in your finances, in your marriage, could be in your career. It can be in life in, in general. Life is never a smooth trip. There are bumps and twists and turns along the way that can cause us to veer off or even take a wrong turn. And when that happens, it can be discouraging. Uh, it can even be overwhelming when we realize we're going the wrong direction. I want to encourage you to turn it around. The worst thing you can do is just keep going the wrong direction, just to give up and, and just keep going even though you know you're going the wrong direction. Uh, the Bible is full of great stories of people getting their lives turned around. Moses, Jonah, David, Elijah, the prophet, the apostle Paul, Peter, who denied Jesus three times. He got his life turned around and ended up preaching on the day of Pentecost. There is a turnaround for you. I want to encourage you to turn it around if you're going the wrong direction. Let me give you three things you need to do to turn it around. One, you need to realize and admit you're going the wrong direction. Until you realize it, until you admit it, you're just going to continue to go the wrong direction. Once you recognize you're going the wrong direction, that will allow you to reevaluate and redirect your life to get it going the right direction. The second is take responsibility. Don't play the blame game. Sure, it's easy to blame somebody else, your spouse, the company, the government, the economy, or anybody else you can possibly shift the blame to. But to turn it around, you've got to take responsibility so that you can then begin to take the steps you need to take to turn the situation around and to do the things that you have control of. You can't control the government, you can't control your spouse, you can't control the company, but you can control what you do. And when you take responsibility, you take ownership of the decisions you've made, you can begin to make new decisions to get you going on the right track. And the third and the last thing to do is to look to God. God is the source of your help. We need to fix our eyes on Him because He's the author and the perfecter of our faith. He's the one who will give us direction and wisdom to going in the right direction. He has the road map. He is the master planner. He's the potter. We're the clay. He's the architect. So we want to inquire of Him. We want to look to Him and check with Him on what direction we need to be going so that we can get things turned around. That's your breakthrough word in a moment. Until next time, remember, you can turn it around. Be blessed.